so hopefully the lighting's okay. I'm not wearing makeup. I look rough. Um, I'm having what you call a birthday hangover. I didn't drink, but like yesterday was just like a long day and I'm just like, I don't know, drained. Um, the sun is coming in from like this window, but it'll be fine. Anyways, this is going to be my, um, like birthday haul slash stop I bought. Um, if you're wondering, my hair is Arctic Fox Poison. All I did was bleached, like, from the root to, like, about here. Because I had some roots and then it was, like, just, just nasty. And then it, like, beat it now. Yeah. So this is all just poison. And it looks like it's not dyed here. And it definitely is. Um, my, my phone camera's having, like, a meltdown I guess and I'm gonna try and do this in one take because I really don't want to do editing and all that stuff anyways so I'm gonna jump around and if you hear like wind blowing I have both my windows open because it's freaking gorgeous it's like 71 degrees um windy and I can't really help it anyways so this came the other I guess I'm already failing, but um, I ordered this the other other week. Um, they were having like a deal. It was from it's from ColourPop. They were having a deal if you bought the Main Squeeze palette, you got a free shadow for their fifth birthday. So of course I got the Main Squeeze palette, and it looks like either a wa a watermelon or strawberry. I think it's supposed to be watermelon, but. Who knows and then there's like the colors um and then of course let's just get into the gorgeousness like look at those colors it's like this it's the red monochromatic palette um so there you go um as you can tell i've already used it i posted no i didn't post a look and i think i already deleted the pictures but I played around with it and they're very pigmented and they're gorgeous so I got this this was $12 $12 for nine shadows that are like really good quality I love Colourpop which um, saying that I actually have two more orders coming in from Colourpop that I placed for my birthday and then this was the shadow that it came with and this is called birthday street and it's in the red packaging and it just has a five on it and then that's what that looks like um normally I don't really go for the like moussey type eyeshadows but this is really pretty it's like a bronzy orangey color with super super sparkles on it um, please excuse my nail I kind of <laughs> broke it um, they're from the Dollar Tree they're just like the Dollar Tree nails that you get and glue on yourself I just wanted to do something for my birthday. Anyways, there's the swatch of that. Well, not really swatch. Um, I will say that this is more on the sheer side. And it looks like there's, like, pink and purple, um, glitters. So. Let's see. I should have just did this from the beginning, but there we go. Like, that's so pretty. Um... It's on the sheer side, so, like, it probably will be better as, like, a, um, eyeshadow topper, so. Yeah. This was the free gift, so. Ooh. And like I said, I will be having two more, um, ColourPop orders. Um, the first order is gonna be three lippies that I'm trying to find the dupe for the, um, Bite Beauty lipstick and chai because I'm not about to spend $26 on a lipstick. Um, but yeah. Anyways, and then the second one is a powder and a gel eyeliner. Okay, moving on. Um, we went to the mall yesterday because I had to go to Sephora and there's like a little Sephora inside the mall. So, of course. Um, I also stopped by Bath and Body Works. <laughs> I was out of soaps from them and I like their soaps for the bathroom whereas like 
in the kitchen you're always using so well i mean you're always using soap in the bathroom too but you know what i mean anyways um i got five for 23 and i can't wait till monday which is the 10th of june today's the 4th of june um which yesterday was my birthday june 3rd anyways um june 10th starts their semi-annual sale and i can't wait to go because i am obsessed with this scent from there it's called boardwalk marshmallow clouds as you can see i've used a ton of it already and it just smells so freaking good and of course when i find something that i love and doesn't like turn scents on me whenever i spray them on my skin it doesn't like mix with my skin pheromones or chemi uh, chemistry weird they uh don't bring it back so um, fingers crossed that they bring it back anyways i got five soaps um i got watermelon lemonade which just smells so good it's juicy watermelons and sweet meyer lemon um basically your typical uh watermelon lemonade scent uh, i got lavender marshmallow which is lavender vanilla marshmallow and warm amber this is like one that i didn't think that i was gonna like because i'm not really one for strong floral scents but the um vanilla and amber really like tone it down for me so this is what this, this one looks like and like i said i really really like that so this one what the heck okay um yeah and then this one's called Wagmore Bar Glass, but it's the orange vanilla scent, and this smells just like an orange cream bar, or orange cream ice cream, like orange and cream swirl ice cream, <laughs> um, it smells so good. And this one is Frozen Sorbet Juicy Orange and Creamy Vanilla, so, yeah, oh my gosh, I cannot wait to start using these. Um, I already picked out one that I'm gonna start using once the one soap that I have in my bathroom is done. Um, and I'm gonna save that for last because, <laughs> yeah. And then this one, my husband actually, well, my husband helped me pick out pick out all these because he obviously was with me. I spent the whole day with him, which, you know, was pretty amazing. Um, this one is Black Cherry Mer Black Cherry Merlot. And usually I don't like cherry scent. Well, that's not, that's not true. I like cherry scents and cherry, like, fake cherry flavors. I don't like real cherries. Anyways, that's what that one looks like. And this is just Dark Cherry, Black Raspberry, and Merlot. It's very fruity, but it also has, like, that, um, like, wine scent. And last but not least is Blueberry Crumble. And this is Fresh Blueberries, Brown Sugar Glaze, and a Dash of Cinnamon. And that's what that looks like. And can I just tell you, I don't know how they did it, but this freaking smells like an actual, like, blueberry pie. I don't, I don't understand. Um, like, it's, like, I smell dough. Like, I smell blueberry and I smell dough. It's freaking crazy, but, yeah. So, five soaps, five soaps for $23, and I'll probably be going back Monday. Because their semi-annual sale starts and then we went to sephora well we went to sephora first but i just want to show you the soaps real quick um we went to sephora no we went to spencer's <laughs> um like i said we went to sephora first but i'm just gonna get these like bigger things out of the way that aren't really makeup um and we were looking at Spencer's. We did go to Hot Topic, but we didn't find anything. Um, anyways, so me and my husband both got two cops there. Buy one, get one 50% off, which is actually a pretty good deal. Um, not, not like we need any more like mugs or cups, but you know, whatever. Um, my husband is a very big Dragon Ball Z fan, and he is obsessed with um, Vegeta. So, he got this cup, <laughs> and it says Cyan, Cyan, Cyan Pride, and the funny thing is that it's, it talks. There's one thing a Saiyan always keeps, is pride! So, yeah, he got that one, 
and I got this one which is kind of my favorite word um I kind of have a mouth like a sailor and I try not to do it too much or well <laughs> let's just not even lie to ourselves I curse a really a lot so I got this one it's uh yeah pretty self-explanatory so and it's huge like look how like compared to my head like look how big that is so yeah we got two cups we also got a harley quinn um steering wheel cover but obviously i can't take that off because it was a bitch to get it on so i'm not gonna even try and then i'll just go jump right over to sephora now this will be all like makeup and beauty products um yeah so of course i got my free gift and it, it was between this or like skincare and i'm not really into skincare which i know is horrible i'm 31 now but i just can't like i get into a routine and then i get and then like i'll miss like one or two days and then like i'll just never go back to it so i picked this one and it's the kat von d set And I know there's so much controversy with her, but, like, makeup is makeup. You know what I mean? Like, I, I can't keep up with all the drama that has even, like, been going on YouTube and stuff. It's, like, so ridiculous. And besides, I'm past the point of, like, dealing or, like, worrying about petty stuff like that. Like, I have bills to pay. I have people to take care of. Like, I can't just like get sucked into the drama even i mean yeah granted sometimes i do but when it comes down to it i don't have time for that anyways it comes with a little like i guess deluxe sample size of the tattoo liner and this is in trooper black and it's so cute it's like the tiniest like here's here's like a normal eyeliner and then here it is um and it's a felt tip and I've never used this before. Well, I never used anything from Kat Von D before, so I don't know. It's not really that, I don't know, it doesn't seem that pigmented. I'll have to keep it upside down so the ink can go into the well more. Well, the ink can go into the, um, whatchamacallit. <clears throat> the ink can go into the felt tip, but anyways and then it also comes with the locket translucent powder which is actually a pretty good size for like being a deluxe sample i guess that's what it is and then of course she's always got the cute little things and then three colors of the studded kiss cream lipsticks which there's outlaw outlaw lolita and vampira now am i gonna go out and spend money on her stuff no because it's expensive and two, um, I'm more of like a drugstore bargain uh, deal uh, shopper. But anyways, um, <laughs> that being said, since it was my birthday, I decided to splurge. And I wanted Perversion from Urban Decay. It's the 24-7 Waterline Eye Pencil. I wanted Perversion, but they were sold out. And I was going to get zero, but then I saw this color. And it's called Legend. I don't know if you can see that. I try so hard, but, you know, whatever. Um, it's called Legend, and I swatched them both together, and Zero seemed more sheer than this one. And also, this one's matte black. So, this is what it looks like. And, sorry if you hear, like, motorcycles and stuff. It's, um, spring slash summer, so, you know. But, anyways. Um. There's that. And I swatched it in store, and it was, like, really pigmented, and it did not go anywhere. I even washed my hands and everything, so I bought it. It was $22, and I know that's a lot for a freaking um, eyeliner, but if you remember, like, a while back, like, I'm talking years back, I got the, um, the whole big eyeliner set for $99, and I use them all the time. Like, they were my holy grail eyeliners, so... I decided to pick that up and that is all I got from Sephora um now 
Uh, these two things. Um, three things I bought on my own. I bought these. I got this at Walmart. I just got the backup of my Mega Liner Liquid Eyeliner from Wet n Wild. And it's in black. It's not the black sparkle because I do have the black sparkle and I don't like it. Um, but this is just plain black, so that was just like a repurchase. And then I got a mascara, which is another repurchase. It's the Mega Volume. Um, I need to get more mascaras because I don't know. Um, my this it seems like these lashes are finally starting to like cooperate with me, but we'll see. And everything's falling. And then I bought this one yesterday. And it's just, this is from the, um, I don't know what, uh, I don't know what, uh, collection is. It's like the rose one or the romance one. I don't know. But this is, um, the Mega Last Liquid Hat Suit Lipstick in Bud Romance. And it's like a mauvey purple color. Well, it's like a, um, blue toned purple or gray toned purple. That's where I was going with this. And I don't think that this is a matte lip. I don't think this is a matte one. I think this is the... Yeah, it's the high shine lipstick. So I think it's going to always have like a glossiness to it. But I thought that was really pretty. And yeah, it's more of a full ball color. But I don't know. I've been wearing like different the colors anyways. Um, and then that's all I got from Rite Aid. And that's all, this is all the stuff I bought. Now I'm going to get into the stuff that I got from my friend Alicia. Um, she sent a birthday box, which I actually came yesterday, which was perfect timing because it came on my birthday. So, um, yeah, I'll just go ahead and dive into this. Um, there was like this, they were in a package, but it came with two beauty, like, they're like the beauty blender dupes, but they look like that. So I can always use them because I actually like them. And right now I'm in a hate relationship with foundation. I don't want to put it on my face. I don't want anything to do with it right now. But that would also work for concealer. Um, hence the reason why I got that powder coming from ColourPop. And then another set had this lip liner and this like holographic lip gloss in it, which is really pretty. It's like a pink color. So I'll swatch this. So there's the lip gloss and then there's the lip liner. Um, it's really pretty and it smells pretty fruity and I like it. And then I think this is, she said that this is a new brand from Family Dollar. Um, or something, it's called Believe Beauty and this is called Plush Purples. And she knows I love my purples, um, which I haven't worn purple eyeshadow in a while, so I think I need to get back into that. But here's what they look like. They're so pretty. There's three of the swatches, which are actually pretty pigmented. Look, look at that. I'm actually very impressed. I cannot wait to use them. So can't wait to try them and I'm gonna try and get back into like doing actual makeup videos but life has just been so freaking crazy I don't know with my car we've had to like put brakes in it get a new tie rod get it inspected new tires cars are freaking expensive it's just it's nuts um and then she also I should have opened this before. And then she um, got me two of the um, trios from the Wet n Wild Crystal Collection something or other. Um, she got me the Rose Quartz one. Which she knows that like rosy tones are also my like current obsession. Um, that's what they look like. I'm not going to do swatches. I probably will use these in a video or something. Like I said, I have a lot of makeup to uh, play around with and whatnot. Um, and then this one is Amethyst. Again, she knows my love of purples. 
That's so shimmery. I hope that's not just like an overspray and I hope it's like all throughout the um, palette. Um, these um, sheet masks. This is the Golden Collagen one. And it comes with two and I can't wait to try that. And then this one is Manuka Honey and Tea Tree Oil. And that. And then the last two things I have to show are actually pretty exciting. So, so I also forgot to mention that my friend also sent um, another liquid lipstick. And it's from Wen Wild. And it's called Demon Damsel. It's from that same rose collection or whatever. Um, this is the matte lipstick. So... It's just like a very nice dark purple, which that is gorgeous. So, and then it comes in like a little sleeve, and it is a 13 color shadow and highlight palette. And this is what it looks like. Like, look how cute that is. Like, do you see? little unicorn and then like the little um let me take this off i should have had it off before but i didn't really think about it and also with these freaking fake nails i'm like i like have trouble okay so here's the actual palette i took the one side off so these three big hearts are the um, highlighter shades, which Ooh, pretty... this one is probably going to be like way too dark for me, so I'll probably use it as an eyeshadow. And then you get the um, eyeshadow, the eyeshadows down here and up here, and I cannot wait to use them because they look freaking gorgeous. Um, oh, they're pretty. Well, okay. Um, yeah, you're not going to be able to see it, but like I said, if you want me to do a video on any of these things, let me know, and I would definitely try and get it done. I know I've said this before, but I said, like, when I first came back that I wouldn't have a set schedule because life is very unpredictable right now. Well, not right now, but life is just very predictable for me lately. And then she also got me the Royal Affair palette, and this one is 20 color, 20 colors, and this one's so pretty. I like this one as well. Ugh. And I cannot wait to use any of these. So yeah, that is everything that I've got. Um, yeah. So like I said, I have a few more orders coming in from Color. Well, a couple more. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be making any more purchases because I've been going crazy, but there was actually a point in time where I, like, kind of just chilled out because we had other things that we had to pay for, like our car. Well, yeah. So, anyways, if you want any, like, reviews or any looks or anything with any of the stuff that I showed, please let me know. And, um, yeah. I will try to do more, like, makeup and oriented tutorials but just doing these like haul videos and like easy videos is perfect for me right now because I can just sit down and talk to a camera and not have to worry about anything. Um, oh my gosh, I am completely, completely forgot. I posted this on Instagram and um, I never did a video on it and I wanted to and I never got it got around to it so my husband you know he's very notorious for ordering things randomly for me and not telling me well he did it again and i've been wanting this since like forever i'm talking about like since it came out which is like what a year maybe a year and a half two years ago i'm not really sure but he ordered me the blood sugar palette from jeffree star and i know he has a lot of controversy as well but you know what makeup is makeup and this is a bunch of colors that i will use and i love and you know what i actually tend to i actually um like him to be honest um yes he does things that i normally would not like you know um i'm not really a fan of but he's apologized and i know you can say sorry so many times but like people change and at the end of the day, like, there's so many people that get offended nowadays. It's, you can't even say anything without 
people getting offended. But anyways, so it looks like this, and it has these like little clasps. Obviously, everyone has already seen it. Um, but yeah. And then, oh, look at that. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I've already used it, and my sister's like, why'd you dig into it? I'm like, I didn't dig into it. I mean, I used it, obviously. But anyways, so pretty. And it's very pigmented, and I'm so happy to have this. He, he's so amazing. Like, I don't know what I did to deserve him, but I'm so grateful. And I never take, I never take advantage of that. Um, yeah. So now I'm completely done. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys that because... Mmm. Because that is amazing. But, yeah. So now I'm completely done. <laughs> I promise. Um, but yeah, if you want any looks or anything, feel free to let me know. Also, I do have a Snapchat. Same name as my Instagram. And I think I changed my YouTube name, too. But I also have Instagram, too. I'll put the links down below. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright. I'll talk to you guys later. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want to if you want me to make more content and I'll talk to you later. Bye!